Hey everybody, welcome back to Witcher Wednesday. In the previous video, we had completed the main storyline quest, Nameless. That was pretty good, it led into Ciri's story, and we now have concluded the search for Ciri in Skellige, and we are going to continue on with the Ugly Baby main quest, because we know who last saw Ciri, basically, and who was last connected to Ciri. And uh, in addition to that, we also checked out a pretty cool Easter egg. I'd highly recommend you check out that video for the Easter egg specifically. That was a lot of fun. It was really interesting to check that out. Something I've never heard of. So uh, yeah, if you're interested, remember, go ahead and click on the top right and that video will be there for you. Um, we also unlocked the return to center achievement. That was awesome. We played some Gwen's, of course, and we completed some contracts. So we did all of that. We were pretty productive in the previous session. And if you did watch the previous session, you may know that um, I had just gotten over a sickness. I had just gotten over a bug and uh, I was feeling good getting back into recording. And fun fact about that, right after that recording, probably a day or two after, oh, I was the sickest I've ever been in a while, so it was pretty rough. And uh, I'm feeling really good now. I'm actually feeling much better than I was uh, just, let's say, like three or four days ago. Three or four days ago, I was in a rough shape, but I'm much better right now. I'm excited to get back into recording. I got a coffee with me just to keep my throat warm and, uh, you know, of course, energize me at the same time. So cheers. We're going to go ahead and honestly get started with, I think some contracts to uh begin things all right let's see what we got let's see what we got wrong menu wrong menu one sec let me take a sip and then let's go to our quest okay so contracts what i want to get to one of them is in skellige we've got dragon i don't know yeah i have collected that great there's a level 28 quest which i think i can do i'm level 24 about to be 25 i'm sure i can handle that and then after that we've got doors slamming shut i think i have that yep door slamming shut we are going to uh, complete that. That is in Novigrad. And then in Novigrad, Novigrad, whatever you want to call it, we are also going to continue on with, or no, uh, uh, Ugly Baby is in Kaer Morin, isn't it? Yeah, it's in Kaer Morin. Hmm. Well, either way, we're going to do those two contracts first. And then I think we might do the last wish. And of course, play Gwent, all that good stuff. And we'll see how much time we take. We might go and do Ugly Baby, start that quest up and uh, see what's up with that. I think that is just uh, overall the plan. So yeah, first things first. We're going to go take care of Dragon. It is not too far off from here. We just need to uh, find a marker or get on Roach. All right. And where did I leave off? Where am I? <laughs> oh, God. That was that was a disgusting sound. My, my throat still has some phlegm in it, so don't mind that. That came out of nowhere. It was just a weird laugh, I guess. Here we go. Wait, what did I leave off doing? What did I leave off doing? Was this for... Roach. Yeah, this is for the um, Here Comes the Groom contract, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, I was on that ridge with uh, the lady. Don't remember her name. Yeah, okay, I remember. I remember where we left off. It looked completely different from that area that I was uh, standing in, so I was quite confused. Um, Roach, please. Please help me out. Oh my god, dude. Please. <laughs> I just want to get to this marker. Uh, okay. Oh, bro, you're kidding me. What's happening? I'm just going to go ahead and run on my goddamn feet. How about that? God damn. All right, here we go. Here we go. Um, we're gonna head over to the village of Firesdal. Sweet. And let's complete Dragon. I'm excited. This should be honestly, I'm expecting this to be a bit of a difficult quest, because I'm level 24. But I like a challenge. You guys know I like to uh challenge myself with these contracts and fight a monster that is a, a tiny bit of a higher level ahead of me. And, you know, not too high, but it's just like the the perfect amount of uh level difference that makes it a bit more difficult, which I am uh a fan of i'm a fan of it i hope all those words made sense i feel like i said a lot of words there you know me you know me anyways let's talk and then what then nothing never you mind this here's a job for a witcher hell yeah let's do it as you wish what's the problem a beast it attacked me, me and my comrade. We'll gut the fucker. Aye, but not us, the Witcher. Why bother the witch man? Like as not it were a pack of wolves. They got you so afeard, you shat yourself and sword specters. Let me round up a few sturdy lads and we'll Yikes. be needed. The Witcher will help, right? Hell yeah. You shan't let us down. Hell yeah, of course. Feral folk, dumbest stumps. What, bro? Uh, he's not talking about me. He's talking about the the guy I'm talking to. He's dumb. He's not that dumb. Chill. Um, what's this about? Tell me. Fine. 
What's this about? Tell me. Probably about a dragon. Come on. Me and my mate were on our way here to Fearsdal with a cart full of hides. Suddenly we heard a screech. Our horse got spooked, started kicking, and then monsters jumped out of the bushes. My mate drew the short straw. They got him first. By some miracle I managed to get away. What kind of monsters? Nekuks. No doubt about it. What? What? You know, sharp claws, animal skulls on their heads, attacking swarms. Neckers? Yeah, neckers. Near 20 of them. Okay. So will you help? Will you kill the bastards? Of course. That road needs to be clear. Aim to travel it again soon. I'll help. Of course I'll help. I'll help you. Grand. Man. Knew a witcher wouldn't let me down. Not like some waffly prick from Clan Drummond. Or Clan Drummond. Oh my god. Good luck, Witcher. Fare you well. I guess Wait, this guy is a bit dumb. Where should I look for you? What? Once I finish, where will I find you? Oh, oh I, I, um, here. I Meaning in the tavern nearby. I'll await you there. Fine. See ya. See ya, buddy. Whoa, where'd the head come from? That floating head. Uh, talk to the village elder of Firesdall. Sure. Oh, a Witcher. What? You Wait, what? Fight the dragon, I reckon. What? Wait, was that... Was I talking to the wrong guy? Was that not about the contract? What? Oh my god, that's so silly. That's so silly. I was just talking to some random dude. Oh my god. Alright, whatever. Anyways, about the dragon. God damn it. I can't believe it. I, I I was in that whole conversation thinking it was about the dragon. <laughs> Bro. God damn. Alright, anyways, about the dragon. Tell me about this dragon. What's it look like, for instance? You don't know. What kind of monster slayer are ye? It's got scales, wings, claws. A dragon's a dragon. Oh, point Gavin. Just go kill it. For it makes more corpses. A dragon's a dragon. Just quick, just quick Gavin. Or, well, I guess no point Gavin. A dragon's a dragon, no point Gavin. Kind of goes hard, not going to lie. Witches Good. don't usually kill dragons, but I'll look into it. You said something about victims, right? Two brothers, Askel and Nilus, went out to hunt. Turned into prey. Wounds so horrible. Even I went weak in the knees when they brought them in. And I've seen my share of bloody harm. Been on 32 raids from Povus to the mountains. Fascinating story, I'm sure. <laughs> but I'm more interested in Bro. those wounds. Can you describe them? Look for yourself. Family's only now preparing the boy's funeral. Their corpses still lie in their home at the village's northern end. But treat the bodies with respect, mind ye. As tradition demands. You got it. You got it. Did I just collect a contract from this guy? Let me check my contracts. Uh, contract, missing son, Skellig's most wanted. Uh, oh, okay. So maybe it was. Yeah, it looks like I just spoke to Skellig's most wanted. That contract. Interesting. Okay, well, I mean, maybe we do that. It's only level 29. One level higher than this. I'm sure I can do it. We'll see, though. We'll see. I want to get to the two uh, contracts I plan to get. So we'll see what happens. Well, well, another come to gawk at the dragon's victims. Perhaps I should start charging for the pleasure. Perhaps. I wouldn't pay you, though. See enough corpses in my line of work. I'm a witcher. Here because I took the contract for that dragon of yours. Oh, for forgive me. I, I didn't know. How, how can I help? Um, the bodies, where were they found? Where were the bodies found? In the glade past the river. The lads, they like that place since Whoa. they were tykes. Damn. They go there to catch hares. Wanna examine their wounds. Might not be easy for you, but I have to look at their injuries. At least you asked me permission, not like the others. If it'll help you kill the beast, fine. Do as you will. That's everything for now. Thanks for your help. And I promise to avenge them. Yeah, damn right I do. Yeah, damn, this guy lost his beat. Claw marks, bite marks, but no fire damage. Interesting. That is interesting, actually. I wasn't thinking about fire. Huh. Okay. So use your witcher senses to follow the monster's tracks to the site of the attack. And it's not too far off. Let's see it. Holy. All right. I'm all healed up. I'm good. I, I got uh, potions refreshed, so we can handle this attack. Pretty weak dragon. Couldn't lift a cow. Just tore it up and left it here. Mm-hmm. Interesting. What kind of dragon is this, huh? Cow's blood. Might lead me to the lair. Hell yeah, let's go. 
All right, follow that blood. We got this. Is that the lair right there? Might be. Seems close enough. Yeah, no fire. Can't lift a cow. Hmm. What kind of dragon is this? Very interesting. Ooh. Bone shattered. Fell from high up. Oh, but it can fly too. Okay. Might just be a weak dragon. A nest. The fork tails looks like. But it's empty. No point waiting. Gotta rustle up some bait. Ooh. Okay. Talk to the village elder and files dar fires doll about bait. You got it. Okay. Oh my god, we're gonna be running back and forth here. Okay, sweet. Oh man. All right, all right. It feels good to be back in in the seat. You know, it feels good to be back in the seat for me. It's been a it's been a hot minute since I last played Witcher. Like I said last time, it's been it was two weeks since last time. Like it. In the last video, it had been two weeks since I last played, but in this video, it's been like about a week and a half since I last played, and it definitely is great to get back in the seat. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. So will you help with the dragon or not? Yeah, I need bait. Found your dragon's nest, but I'll need bait to kill it. A sheep, for instance. Ah, I see. You're gonna stuff it with sulfur. It's not a bad idea. Uh, another ally of the brave little shoemaker. Now I'll manage without sulfur. Just need a sheep, unseasoned. Fine. There's one I can give you. A bit mangy, but it'll do. Know how to get a sheep to move where you want? You've gotta drive it like a sheep dog. Go at it from the left, it'll go oh right. Oh my god. Go at it from the right, it'll if go If dogs have figured it out, think I'll manage as well. That's funny. Okay. Alright, sweet. So we have to escort a sheep to get over there? <laughs> god damn. How do you call a sheep? Here, sheepy, sheepy. Hey, sheep, come here. We got us a fork tail to hunt. Yeah, come on, sheepy, sheepy. Come on, sheepy, sheepy. Giddy up, sheep. Yeah, giddy up, sheep. Oh, God. Maybe maybe I'm not as good as a dog. If I can't do this right. God damn, come on, Mia. Aw, <laughs> Mia's about to die, bro. I feel bad. All right, keep moving, Mia. Keep it moving. Nice, nice, perfect. You're doing so well. Oh, man, I'm so proud of you. Sorry you're about to die. <laughs> I hope Mia survives. That'd be great. That'd be very nice. Come on, Mia. Let's move. I'm waiting on you. Oh, my God. You can't go around rocks? What's going on? Mia. Come on, now. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. All right. Too much. Too much. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Perfect. Keep it moving. Come on. Keep moving along. Keep moving along. Please. Please, Mia. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? We're almost in the circle. We made it to the zone. All right. Come on, Mia. Why are you stuck? Why, do, why, why does the sheep keep getting Final stuck game. on weird spots? All right, we got dragon. Let's kill dragon. Oh, dragon. We got it. Oh, no, no not Mia. No. No, leave her alone. Oh, Mia's dead. That's so sad. Uh, do I have draconid oil? I might. But it looks like this thing is getting taken out super easy. Let's be honest. Does it get damaged by fire? It does. Wow. You suck. Uh, Here we go. Here we go. Let's get... Uh, what is it? Dragon's Dream? Hell yeah. Boom. Let's go. Oh, good explosion, dude. Hell yeah. You love to see it. All right. Another one. Bam. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh, we did a lot of damage there. Sweet. I'm going to put on Quen. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. All right. Dragon. It's weird that, it, that it's called Dragon. <laughs> uh, okay. Anyways, let's go ahead and... Oh, I want to hit it with Dancing Star. Hell yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Take it out. I might try and hit it also with a Winter's Howl. What's this called? Northern Wind. No, Winter's Howl. <laughs> what is Winter's Howl? Why did I think it was that? Uh, Northern Wind didn't do too much, but we're frying this thing. What's going on? Why does it suck? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Damn, dude. All right. This level 28 dragon is easy peasy. Yeah, this is way easier than I expected. Oh, damn. Good freaking attack over there for you. Oh, my God. All right. Here we go. Bam. Let's go. Cool. Yeah, come on. Hit me. Hit me, boy. All right. We're good. We're good. We're good. No running away from us, dragon. All right. All right. You're right in front of us. We got you. We got you. I'm going to hit Thunderbolt real quick. Yeah. Just do a ton of damage. We don't even need oil to uh, do enough damage here. We're just crushing it. We are seriously crushing it. Bam. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. Hold on. I reapplied Quen. I don't even know if I needed it, but just in case. I also got to repair my sword. Shouldn't be too bad. That's a very easy task. All right. Come on. Let's go. Ooh. 
All right, uh, Northern Wind Time. Why the hell not? Bam. I don't think that did anything, but it's fine. We're here for it. We just wanted to uh, do something. Rape shot time. Let's go. Bam. That, that did nothing as well. Damn. I don't even know what... Uh, is it a fork tail? I don't even know what fork tails are weak to necessarily. But I'm just I'm just fighting it. I'm just fighting it. And we're winning. We're doing everything right. So, you know. no, I, I don't think I'm doing anything, uh, you know, wrong. But I could be more efficient, I'm sure. Oh, we're crushing it. We got... This. Oh, 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 oh. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful, huh? Yeah, start healing up, please. Holy. Bam. Let's go. Let's go. All right, here we go. Bam. Let's also hit it with Igni while we're at it. Actually, I'm going to go and reapply Quen since I got damaged. Bam. Let's go. Let's go. Here we go. Bam. I'm going to do a heavy attack. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. Nicely done. Nicely done. All right, sweet. Oh, yeah. It's on fire. And we're going to burn it to death. We just burned a dragon to death. You love to see it. All right. Sweet. Now let's take a trophy from Dragon. Thank you very much. You died for a good cause, sheep. Yeah, that Best sheep piece. did die for a good cause. Poor Mia. Poor Mia. It's nice knowing you. Damn. Sad times. Sad times. Yeah, let's a let's a actually uh, go ahead and collect that raw meat. You know, put Mia to use. I feel bad sacrificing her for that. Okay. Uh, look at all this loot from, like, probably from contracts and stuff. That's crazy. Uh, let's see. Did I have Draconid Oil? I could have checked during the fight, but I just didn't. I do not have Draconid Oil. I'm actually surprised. Okay. No problem there. I'm going to go ahead and repair the sword while we're here. I haven't actually repaired a sword in a long time. So this is weird because I've normally repaired them like at the uh, blacksmith and stuff, right? Like I don't normally repair them with my repair kits. So I have a ton of repair kits. We just go to Novgrad so often that it's like, why would I need to repair them myself? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, whatever. Let's go ahead and collect our reward and then let's get over to our next contract. Although we might save the contract for later. We'll see what we'll see what's up. We'll see what's up. I don't know what I'm gonna do just yet. Okay, here we go. Let's get over here. Bam. Vaughn, give us our reward. Help with the dragon or not. Problem solved. solved your problem. And that it? Tell me more. Did the dragon breathe fire to spit venom? None of that. Yeah, and it had golden scales. <laughs> Buddy. Yeah. And it had golden scales and smoke poured out its ass like it does out of a chimney. Just like the skulls sing it. You've earned your reward. And the princess's hand. But I'll just take the coin. That's funny. Hey, level 25. Let's go. We have eight points available for upgrades. Do I have a slot available for upgrades? I do not. So there's nothing for me to upgrade yet. I don't think anything needs to be boosted. But we're about to get another slot at level 26. And let's not forget... I can craft the new uh, upgraded set of Griffin armor at level 26. So hopefully we're able to uh, level up by the end of this video. I know I'm going to be doing a lot. So fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead. Honestly, since we're in Skellige, let's do the last wish. Let's go to secondary quests. Let's take care of the last wish for Yennefer. Should be uh, a good time. All right. And then uh, after that, maybe we do some Gwent. Maybe we go to the other contract. We shall see. I'm not too sure what the plan is, but there is an achievement in Gwent that uh, I'm looking to unlock. It's for getting a ton of points. And I think it's actually on this island that we're going to play a lot of Gwent. Let's see. Is it this island? I have a picture right beside me of the island. Yeah, this island actually has a lot of Gwent players. So if we end up staying here during this quest, um, I'm going to try to do that or just return back here and do that. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. That's for later. Right now, let's focus on Yennefer. Let's focus on her and her quest line. She needs a favor for us, and we're going to take care of it. I'm going to go ahead and replenish my potions, and uh, let's continue on. All right, bam. Let's save while we're at it, just in case. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going, guys. All right, Yennefer, what you laughing at? Oh, my God. She's not laughing. She's angry. Oh, my God. Yennefer, chill out. Holy, what is she doing? Is she suffocating someone? God damn. Always did know how to oh, my God. I was provoked. Mm hmm So it happened. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Far Ipsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he penned in the Emperor's library. Far Ipsis set off for Skellige one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember him. What happened to him? Why are you even interested? Yeah. Why are you even interested? Jinns are dangerous sometimes and malicious all the time. I remember. But the advantages outweigh the risks. If I can tame a djinn, 
Okay. I shall gain incredible power. And that could be useful to us one of these days. Agreed. Nowhere to look? Nowhere to look for the mage and the djinn? The locals say they last saw Amos's ship off the coast of Hindisfjall, just before a once in an eon storm broke. Dad will find them then. Mage is probably fish food, and the djinn escaped. Not necessarily. But even if it is so, I'll not give up without seeing some evidence. Will you help me? Yeah, of course. I've no gold to offer in reward. But I shall be ever so grateful. Of course, for Yen? Anything. Of course I'll help you. Since you put it that way, fine. I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Alright, go to Larvik's Harbor with Yennefer. You got it. Bestiary entry added gin. everything already. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it. Damn. Yeah, I'm just I'm just that that loyal. She's easy to know uh if I'm gonna say yes or not. But let's enhance our items, of course. We gotta take advantage of that while we're here. Um if I have a bestiary for the gin, I'll know its weaknesses once we get to it. Would you even let me? It would depend on the situation. I don't know what they just said. But they're they're flirting. They're flirting like usual. Alright, let's see. Yeah, let's get on our boat. Let's get going. Did I just start diving? I think I did. The ship carrying the gin sank somewhere in this area. Not too precise as leads go. I'll cast a spell on our boat. We'll know if there are any wrecks on the seafloor below us. Interesting, okay. All right, let's get to work. Mind if I take the helm? <sighs> I got a choice. No. <laughs> That's funny. That's interesting. It's like, I don't think we've ever had a quest that is, uh, do I sit on the opposite side or beside her? Uh, I get, oh yeah, I sit on the opposite. Wait, I can take the helm? No, I can't. Do I sit on the opposite side? What's happening? Where do I go? I'm in. What do you mean? What's happening? Oh, let's go back in. All right, are we going? Can I sit down? Hello? I'm ready. Ready to go. Or do I have to talk to her? Oh, I can't even talk to her. What's happening? <laughs> What's happening? Hello, Yennefer. I'm in. Can I can I go? Oh my god. Alright. I don't know what's happening. I'm gonna reload. Can I reload? Hopefully it's not too far away. Uh yeah, right here. Sweet. I'm gonna reload because apparently it bugged. I was getting in the boat, I swear. But I was trying to say, at least I think I was trying to say, it was in my mind. So I think I was trying to say something. Um I don't think we've ever had a quest that is like taking place in a boat. So this is interesting. This is the first. Oh, oops. Yennefer, don't leave. Don't leave without me. Don't leave without me. Please. <laughs> I didn't mean to jump out. Damn it. All right, here we go. I'm in. Let's get going, Yennefer. Getting in or not? I'm in. I'm in. Please, don't be so mean to me. Uh, what's going on? Here we go. I guess I was supposed to take a seat on the opposite side, but there was no thing telling me to sit. This time it worked, sure I guess. Whatever. Gin thing's a good idea. We managed to seize one before. Do you remember? Of course. And the lion almost lost his voice that time. <laughs> how lucky your exorcism saved it. It was pointed. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that incantation meant be gone and plow yourself? You should have studied foreign languages. Gonna keep bringing that up for the rest of my life. Of course. Your last wish effectively assured it. My wish was about us being together always, not about you mocking my every mistake. When your wish is granted, you must accept it with all attendant circumstances. Yeah. And as for your missteps, I don't like to see why I shouldn't laugh at their amusing. Interesting. There's something here on the bottom. It's too deep here. You can't dive that long. You underestimate me. On the contrary. After all, I asked you for help. I'll cast a spell. It will slow your heart for a time. You can stay submerged. Cool. Asad, I cried a revolve. All right. Careful down there. Let's get going. I'm gonna have my bow with the ready. But yeah, they were talking about. It was interesting. They were talking about um, how there was a a curse or a spell on them that they have to be intertwined forever, and that's why they're stuck together. Right? That's like I know that especially. Oh, can I go down? Oh my God! How do I dive? X. I'm holding X. Can we go. Jesus. I know that especially from uh the the Witcher show. Because I've never read the books and I don't, I've never played the other games. So, uh, yeah, it's interesting that they're talking about that. 
Search the bottom of the bay. How's it going? Gotcha. Yeah, and you know I hate it when you read my mind. Strictly speaking, I'm not reading your mind, but using telepathy. Besides, you've nothing to hide, right? Who would Damn right. If I did, not the point. See anything interesting? A shipwreck in the cavern. I'll look inside. Yep, we're going inside. Interesting. This is cool. This is a cool quest where she's like talking in our head, like we're able to communicate underwater. Pretty cool. Um, I'm about to leave the zone. Let's check this out. Snapped masts, busted planks, and a whole swarm of drowners. Probably drawn by the corpses of drowned crew, then made their nest here. There's also a clan drum and figurehead. Cool. What was this? Was this like a corpse of an, like, or a shell of an Arakas or something? That's pretty cool. All right, we're returning to the boat. It's that easy. The surface. Cool. This is cool stuff. I like this. I like how we're able to search underwater freely and not have to be concerned about, uh, you know, drowning. I dig it. Oh, yeah, look at the drowners. They made it to the surface. We took them out. All right. Hey, look at this. This is nice. This is a nice quest. All right, let's get on. Um, okay. And let's get in. Where to now? Wherever the leads take us. Leads? Wherever the leads take us. Okay, gotcha. Are we gonna move? Are we stuck on drowners? What's going on? Yennefer? Um. Say we find the djinn. What'll you do? Ask for a beautiful house? And a palace? And a queen's crown? Are we still talking about the djinn? Or have we moved on to a talking fish? Doesn't much matter. Both make wishes come true. What would yours be? You learn in time. There we go. We got out. I couldn't do anything there. I couldn't do anything. I couldn't disembark. I I was just we were just stuck. Jeez. We're moving quick. Holy, look at this. And yeah, we're going quick because we were stuck for so long. That's hilarious. Alright, sweet. Look at that. What a What a calming mission. We're just on a boat. This is awesome. Look at that scenery. Whoa, look at that behind us. Wow. Ooh, what's over there? There's a ship. It's just a random ship. Wow. Okay, cool. Is this the next spot? I see a ship sticking out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is, it is. Something's here. Another wreck. Let's yeah. see if our gin's down there. Let's go. Bam. All right, dive down. Let's go. Oh, boy. This one's, this one's cool. I like how this one's not in a cave. I like how it's on like a cliffside underwater. It's been here a while. Woods rotted. Look around, but be careful. Look for something that might indicate it's the mage's ship. All right, what's this? Got something. A Skelliger's buckler. Clan Haymai symbols. Donar's clan. Donar was a babe in swaddling clothes when this buckler landed here. Okay. Interesting. Looks like probably got to go onto the opposite side, maybe? Yeah, probably got to go up. Look for more clues over on this side. Let's see what we got. Let us see what we've got. Uh, skeleton? Okay. A man's skeleton. Somebody pinned his skull to the deck with an axe. Damn, Damn brutal. Of a Skelliger. Clan emblem indicate. Yeah. Got oh, oh, I skipped everything. Buckler. My bad. Clan Haymai symbols. All right, so Don't all we know is that it wasn't the ship, I guess. Here. Got something. A Skelliger. Oh my God! I I guess I pressed A way too much. I was just trying to loot, guys. I was just trying to loot. When this buckler landed here. All right. Anyways, let's get going. Let's get going. Can I take this thing out? Please leave me alone. Thank you. Oh, damn. I killed it before it landed in the water. That's awesome. All right. Let's get going, Yen. Let's get going. Ooh, we're, we got a trek to go to on that side. Go even quicker if you helped me down there. I prefer to observe matters from the key. Yeah, like when we were looking for the golden dragon and the avalanche swept us off the trail. Me clinging to the remains of a bridge for dear life. You gripping my waist, admiring the view. Remember, the chasm below us was breathtaking. Rustling trees, a lazily flowing stream. I remember. Well, I found myself admiring the way I right before. That's funny. That's funny. Okay. I like this area. This looks promising. We got stuff around us. Something strange about those rocks. And there's something on the bottom. Let's see what it is. Alright, let's go. Let's see what's next. Dive down. 
Let's go. Oh, boy. We got drowners. Or sirens. Oh, boy. I'll kill you. Stay away. Stay away. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Didn't even look like they were trying to hurt me. Oh, my God. Ow. That was a crazy noise. It was like a death noise that, that Geralt made there. All right, let's take him out. Come on. All right, we got one left. Ow! Jesus, do you hear Geralt? He's like, that's like a death noise. All right, there we go. Now let's move forward. Down below. Holy, how deep is this? We've, ne we've never gone this deep. That's for See sure. something? Something doesn't do it justice. A huge crater as if a meteorite yeah. landed Yeah. I must see it. Diving in after all? No, I should cast another spell to Bro. see through your eyes. Now relax. I see Fultia Badem Ein Eichter Elevate. Okay. Anyways. Broken seal? I see Fultia Badem Ein Eichter Elevate. Why is she still chanting? Chill. Okay? Chill out. Can I examine this? It's not letting me. I'm gonna spam A until Super. it lets me. Pearl encrusted cutlery. Should belong to someone awfully wealthy. Amos. Hmm. Oh, oops, skip that. My bad. Basket exactly in half. Oh yeah, that's interesting. Oh, here we go, here we go. What's on top? I can't examine it. It's not letting me. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, yeah, I'd love to look at it. I'd love to do something. Um, ooh, what's on that side? There's something all the way over there. Jeez. A mission and a half. All right, let's loot this stuff on the way, at least. Okay, bam. And bam. And then here we go. We've got it up here. Let's go. What do we got? What do we got? Transverse cut through the pelvis. Surgical precision. No conventional weapon can do this. But whatever cut the basket probably could. Transverse cut through the pelvis. Oh, <laughs> I pressed precision. it twice. My bad. No conventional weapon can do this. But whatever cut the basket probably could. Okay. Okay, return to the boat. Gotcha. I didn't realize. I don't know when it tell, told me to return. But I just noticed it now. All right, sweet. Very curious. What is she doing? There's like pulsating. What's going on? Is that her powers? Is that what's pulsating? What's doing that? It's crazy. It's kind of scary, not gonna lie. And right, let's go up. Yeah, look at that. There's like pulsating. I guess it's the... She like enchanted the ship to see below. Is that what we're seeing? I don't know. Let's see what we got. All right, Yennefer. Let's get going. Oh, is that it? Only found half. Can you do anything with this? I can use it to locate the other half. To within a dozen yards. And once we find that, we should find the djinn. Exactly. Ready? I'll take us there on the count of three. Oh, oh no, not another portal. Stop whining. One, two. Three. Still in Skellige. Said you were gonna go on three. I did. Look, we must search the area. Yen, not so fast. Gotta tell me what this is about first. Why do you want this djinn? But you already know. A djinn's power is priceless to a mage. Tell me or I leave. Yeah, tell me or I leave. Won't worm your way out of it. Not this time. Tell me the truth or I'll leave. You needn't resort to blackmail. You would have learned eventually. True, but after the fact, I want to know now. <sighs> How long has this been going on, Geralt? This thing between us. 15, 20 years? We repeatedly split up, then return to one another. Something draws us to each other, but I can never be certain if it's a true feeling or merely a bit of mischief by a djinn. So that's it. This is about my last wish. Ah. You asked that djinn to bind us together forever. I want to ask this one to take that wish back. Why? No, let's say I understand. Because I do understand. I get it. You want to know what'll happen if magic no longer binds us. I want to know if when the djinn's magic is gone, if we've any magic left of our own. Ooh, I like that. All right. Yeah, let's do it. Hmm. Wondered that myself many times. Very interesting. You see, we're just a step away from learning the truth. Come, let's search the ship. Okay.
All right, let's get going. Let's search the ship. This is cool. I like this a lot. Amos was quite the eccentric, asking the Jin to lift half his ship to a mountaintop. He didn't necessarily. Jins are inherently mischievous. This one might have granted his wish and perverted it in doing so. In that case, I'd appreciate it if you didn't wish I'd disappear from your life. And yet to decide how to word it. I don't know what she just said. It didn't have subtitles. But look at this crazy. Oh my god, this is a crazy view. We're still technically in Skellige, but oh my god, where the hell are we? Let's look at the map. Let's look at the map. Oh wait, I was on the right menu. My bad, my bad. Uh, world map. Oh wow. Cool. Doesn't feel like we're here. But wow, it's the giant's toes. That's crazy. Okay, it's pretty cool. All right, let's, let's search the ship. Let's see what we got. Nothing interesting. Okay, nothing interesting. Just a, just a thing. Just a what is that? A vase, I guess. Yeah. Nothing here. All right. Then we got uh, right over here. We got some loot. Let's grab that. Then let's go up above. I saw there was a lower flow floor. Lower flow. Lower floor. We'll go there in just a moment. Okay, and this is probably where we're gonna find what we need. Long claw for diagram. Cool. All right. Superior Maraboa Forest. Agnes of Glanville. Cool. Elemental Empires by Jean Batista. Interesting. We're getting so much loot. Mage must have slept here. All right, what's this? What do we got? Nice shoes. Looks like the impact with the mountain was so powerful it popped the wearer right out of them. That's funny. That's really funny. All right, uh, we got this. I wonder what this means. Sweet. Oh, we got to move something. Blood. Someone was dragged across the deck. War left this mark when the ship suddenly tipped to oh, one side. A person got crushed by this thing. That's Blood. hilarious. Well, Someone not that was hilarious, but you get what deck. I mean. That's like crazy. War left this mark when the ship suddenly tipped to one All side. All right, shush up, Geralt. Goddamn. All right, he, li he put it back up. Again, think you should see yeah, this. that sucks. They got crushed and have? then it got dragged. It's Amos. Looks exactly like the etching in the book. Except his head oh, was intact there. Need to search his body. If he died while being teleported, Seal might still be on him. Behold. Hey. Bravo. Come to the deck. I've an idea. So is that the seal for the djinn? What, what is that seal for? I'm kind of confused. Cold's preserved the corpse. Hmm. Died from head trauma. Bookcase cracked his skull. Jeez. Must have been a hard landing atop this mountain. Yeah, goddamn. All right. Come with me. I have an idea. She has an idea. We're coming with her. Step back a bit. What are you going to do? Summon and tame the djinn. It's not likely to be happy. Stand at the ready. Tame Are we going to fight it? Riff Kaishta Aeng Gaia. Kaishta et Displayer. Divirid me castle. We're definitely fighting it. That is awesome. That was really cool. Alright, let's get to it. Oh my god, chill, chill, bro. Oh my goodness. You must weaken him while I draw him into the sphere. Weaken how? What do you mean? Oh my god. How do we weaken it? Let's let's go to the beast area. I guess this is the only thing we can do. So go to beast area, go to uh I don't even know what this would be. It's not a vampire. Would it be a hybrid maybe? Uh Jin, no. It's not a necrophage. What is this? How do we even see it? Cursed one. A djinn is not a cursed one. Draconid is not that either. It's not an elementa. No, it is an elementa. Okay, so dim dimeridium bomb and elementa oil. Gotcha. I'm going to go ahead and throw down a dimeridium bomb like right away. Okay. All right, elementa oil time. We'll go ahead and equip that. And uh, let's throw down dimeridium. Let's do it. Bam. Let's go. Chill, 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 bro. Oh, my God. Relax. Ow. This hurts a ton. Uh, did not mean to use uh, Ard. Okay. Oh my god, dude. I'm about to die. I'm actually about to die from this thing. Yo, chill. Relax. Stop, please. Ow. Stop. Oh my god, dude. All right, we're hitting it. It's got it's got a form. It's got a corporeal form. We're, we got it. We got it. Ow. Oh my god. 
Stop! Please, dude! Holy! Alright, here we go, here we go. Bam, I'm not even doing much to it. This is bonkers. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're safe for like a moment. Alright, let's go. Yeah, keep, keep attacking. Keep doing that. Here we go. Bam, we're gonna go for it. Ow! Dude! Stop! Stop, please. Ow! Oh my god, you see? This was ridiculous. How are we supposed to fight this thing? Alright, let's, let's run it back. That was crazy. That was just crazy. Oh my god. Alright, we got it. Whew. We got this. I know how to fight it. I hope. I think. I think we got this. Let's do it, Yen. Let's do it. Follow Yenna further to the top deck. We gotta go through this sequence over and over again. Oh, bye. Here we go. Alright, skip, 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 skip. Let's go. Alright, let's fight this thing. Alright, we got this. Oh, boy. Relax, buddy. Relax, Jin. Alright, sweet. Now we're gonna go. Oh, could I use a bolt to, like, hit it? And, like, stun it for a moment? Potentially. I don't know for sure, though. Damn, bro. I already lost so much health. Stop. Please stop, bro. Oh, my God. Alright, let's use freaking Igni. Let's see if Igni does work. Holy, this thing is no joke. Oh, my God. Igni does nothing. What do I do? Holy, dude. All right, come on. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, relax, relax, relax. Oh, my God. All right, here. Bam. I'm just going to, like, keep attacking it. This is legit all I can do. I can't do anything else. So, that's what we're going to go for. Please, no, 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 no. Ow. Okay, here we go. Bam, bam. I'm going to go ahead and put uh, Quen back on. I, I feel like we just got to damage it to, like, even a third. And then Yennefer is going to hop in and take care of it for us. I think that's what's up. You know, let's, let's not stress about killing it. Let's just stress about damaging it, period. Holy. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. I'm alive for, like, a moment more. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. All right, here we go, here we go. Just stay on the opposite side of the pole. We got to heal up. We got to heal up big time right now. Oh, my God. All right, here we go. And bam, let's go. Take it down, take it down. Come on, Yen. Jump in. I need you. I need you. I need your support, please. All right, here we go. And come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Come on, Yennefer. Bro, I damaged this thing so much. I need your support. I need you to help me out. All right, come on, come on. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, almost there. Almost there. I feel I feel like we're, we're, at the, we're at the tip of it. I know we're so close. Yeah, do it, dude. Come on, you suck. You suck, Jin. All right, here we go, here we go. Bam, let's go. Let's go just a bit more. Hell yeah, just a bit more. I got it halfway, basically. Jeez. Oh my goodness. Here we go, here we go. Is it? Is it? Oh my god. That's not it. Stop. Ow. <laughs> please, no. Uh, where is it at? Here we go, here we go. Oh, dude. Just die already, please. This is ridiculous. Ow, ow, ow. Shit. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. Oh my god. All right, I'm, I'm, in, I'm getting, like, toxified or whatever. I'm getting hurt by toxicity. We're not in good shape. We're not in good shape right now. I'm, I'm telling you that much. I'm going to heal below for a moment. God damn. This is ridiculous. Chill out, dude. Holy. All right, here we go. We're going for it. We're going for it. Let's go. Bam. Here we are. Yeah, last few hits. Last few hits. I should have put on elemental oil through this entire fight. Wasted opportunity, but I, I didn't expect it to go on this long. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Jin is taken out. Oh my God. What an asshole. Did she finally stop it? Jeez, thank you. Yennefer, it took Got long you. enough. Your oh. master died before uttering his last wish. I cannot capture you. We can struggle like this for eternity or I can release you. If you do one thing for me. <sighs> do you see the spell that binds us? <sighs> Only a djinn can remove another djinn's spell. Remove this one and you'll be free. All right. You are free. Wow, it's that easy. Cool. I like that. Good teamwork, Yennefer. Good teamwork. Storm's over. Yes. It's all over. Maybe we should sit. You look a bit dazed. I'm not, but we can sit. Yeah, let's sit. Bit better now? We beat the djinn. Bit better now? That's what I'll ask. Feel any better? I told you, I'm fine. Don't need to play tough for me. 
That was a hard fight. Maybe not as hard as the last time we tamed a djinn, but still. <laughs> no comparison, I'm afraid. Half of Rhind suffered then. Now I'm merely a bit tired. <laughs> okay. Thank you for coming, Geralt. I'd have had a much harder time of it on my own. My pleasure. My pleasure. Couldn't have refused, yeah. Well, I didn't have refused. Never could say no to you. Hmm. Oh boy, chill out, Geralt. Perhaps that will change now. Hmm. Feel anything? That anything's different? Hmm. I expected... I don't know what I expected, actually. A bit of vertigo, perhaps. I thought... You'd become a stranger to me. That I'd look at you and not feel a thing. Interesting. But it's not like that at all. Nothing's changed. Uh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Holy dude. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Like, okay guys. Here's here's my thought process. Like, we're, we're with Triss, right? We are with Triss. And uh, we professed our love to Triss. And, um... Oh, feel so bad about Yen. Oh my God, I don't want to say no, but I have to say no. But I don't want to say no. I don't know what to do. Um, sorry, but I don't want to be with you anymore. It's so vicious. It's just like cold. It's like, it's like, I don't know what to do. I don't. I feel mean. I feel actually mean doing that. Oh no. What do I do? What do I do? Okay. All right. So let's just say. Um, let's just say we've, uh, <laughs> let's just say we don't love Triss anymore. Let's say we love them both. Should, uh, I feel so bad. I don't know. I don't know. You know what? It's out of my hands. I don't, I, I think, I think, I think the call is just to say, I still love you too. I don't know. I don't want it to be sorry, but I don't want to be with you anymore, but I also do want it to be that. I don't know. Oh, it's so hard. Like, Triss and, and Geralt, there was magic in the air when, when that happened. And right here, there's even more magic. We're on a freaking beautiful view. Like, we have everything's everything works for them. And they has, it, she had such a nice speech. It's like, oh, this is more, this is way better than Triss's moment. I gotta be honest. If I knew this would happen, I wouldn't have gone for Triss. You know what I'm saying? All right, you know what? Screw it. I'm, I'm not, I'm not looking. I'm not looking. I'm just gonna do this. You know what? I'm just gonna do this. We're just, we're just gonna see what happens. All right? Can I can I go up? All right, yeah, I can go up. So I'm just gonna go up an endless amount of times, not even count. Okay? It's so like you guys can see I'm right here, and you guys know what I'm about to hit. Oh god! Oh god! I don't know what I don't know what to hit. I'm just gonna let fate decide. Okay? We are gonna go in three, two, one, and we do it. I don't know what it was. Jen might have cheated us after all. Why? Because I don't feel that anything's oh, changed either. Oh, God! I still love you too. That's what I chose. Oh, God. Oh. I love you, Yen. <laughs> and I love you. Oh, no. I'm sorry, Triss. Fate decided it. I didn't even choose it. Fate decided it. Oh, God. I'm happy for him, I guess. And he's all toxic and shit. Oh, that's gross. That's gross, Yennefer. Let him meditate first. Goddamn. Oh, what was that? It can't be all sweetness and light. Strange. Done that so many times. But it felt like our first kiss to me. That's so cute. Way. Besides, once you say I love you, a kiss has to taste differently. That's so cute. Oh my god. That that was so nice. Like uh, that dialogue is so awesome. Yeah, I would have I would have I would not have picked Triss if I knew this was going to happen, but the the Triss moment had so much magic. But guys, you saw it happen. You saw it happen. That was fate deciding us going on, telling her I love you. That was fate, okay? I could not avoid it if I even tried, okay? It, it just happened. All right, what now? Yeah, what now? What's next? Got any plans? That depends what you mean. We must find Ciri and then defeat the hunt. But I doubt the world will end if we sit here a while. Oh. Wow. Look at that. <sighs> My, it's lovely. How could you not love that? Mm hmm. Think the spirits of Skellige favor us. 
What a view. Oh, That's nice for them. What I like about that is they didn't even bang. It was just like romantic and sweet. And they love each other. Oh, that was really nice. And we made Next it back. Next time we go on horseback. A horse would never make it down that mountain. What now? Well, I'm due to appear in Vizima. Um, let's talk before you leave. Yeah. Yen, what happened back there? Was very nice. Let's not ruin it by hashing out the details. I'm going to see the Baron. Collect Uma from him, then we'll ride for Kaer Morin. I shall join you as quickly as I can. The Baron's dead, see though. Yen. Take care of yourself. I guess there's a new Baron? That's what he mean? That's what he meant? I don't know. Alright. The last wish has been completed. We told Yen that we love her. And, uh, remember, I didn't decide it, guys. Fate decided it. We chose it random. So you can't blame me. You can't blame me for cheating on Triss. Now it, now Yen's the main. Oh, God. I feel so bad. Yeah, but it's okay. It's okay. It, what happens, happens. It's okay. <laughs> now we live with the consequences. Okay. Um, now that we've done that, let's go ahead and play some Gwent. Yeah. Let's take care of some Gwent. Um, once we do arrive on this island, I'll let you guys know what the plan is. I'm going to set up a, a Nilf Guardian deck. And uh, yeah, that's what's up. So we land in Larvik. And in Larvik, there is one, two, three, four games of Gwent for us to play. I think uh, the Blacksmith, the Merchant, the Innkeep, and then someone else on the other side that way so uh yeah that is what is up all right so really quickly i'm going to save the game and then we're going to be building out a gwent deck for the nilf guardians and this gwent deck is actually uh if you check the description below you'll see uh information for the achievement killed it you'll see a link to uh where i got this information for building out this gwent deck so uh, you can do it as well if you're looking to unlock this achievement nilf guardians are apparently the best deck to get uh what is the amount to get a minimum of 187 points so uh yeah that is what we are setting up for we want to get the achievement killed it within uh these four gwent matches we want to try for it and this build that this build out is going to be the best for it so uh if you want to skip past this go ahead this is me setting up the gwent deck and then uh, we're actually playing gwent in a few minutes i don't know how long it's going to take but uh yeah if you want to skip it go ahead and skip to i don't know the time codes check the time codes below i'll pro probably have the chapters out but We'll be quick. We'll be quick. I swear we'll be quick. Okay. So first up is leader, Emir. How do I change the leader? How do I change the leader? Is it Y? No. How do I change the leader? How do I... Um, let's go to Nilfgaardian Empire. How do I change the leader? That's so weird. Um, We're going to start with... Let, let's just start with everything else. Then we'll get to the leader card. Oh, change leaders. X. Uh, bro, can I read? My God. Anyways. Anyways. So we go... So the leader, Amir the Relentless, which I do have, great. And that allows you to take an extra card and, you know, that has a chance to be a spy, which is good. And then after that, we are going to go and add two times Commander's Horn. We are going to add Geralt, Siri, Yennefer. Let's go here. Geralt, Siri. Let's go ahead and find Yennefer. Here we go. Geralt, Siri, Yennefer. Then I don't have Triss. The, the, the thing says add Triss, but I don't have Triss. So uh, that's unfortunate, but that's fine. We're going to add Bilentremeth. We are going to add Dandelion, who is right over here. We're going to add the Mysterious Elf. We are going to add Letho of Gullet. We are going to add Menno Morvran. There we go, Menno uh, Morvran. I don't know who Morvran is, maybe over here. Hello, Morvran. Where would Morvran be? I don't know who Morvran is. <laughs> there we go, Morvran Vorheers. There we go. And then Tibor. Whoever Tibor is, no clue. Tibor Egbrak. There we go. So those are the hero cards that we have uh, assigned. And then we are going to get Black Infantry Arthur. We're going to put both of them. Uh, Heavy Z Fire Scorpion. That's what we are doing. Heavy Zaracanian Fire Scorpion. Stefan Skellen. Ooh, I don't know who that is. Stefan Skellen. Stefan Skellen. We're looking for Stefan Skellen. I may not have Stefan Skellen, but we shall see. Um, I don't know. I got no clue. I got no clue. I got no clue. Stefan Skellen is. So we're just going to say, this is fine. We're going to skip that. Not a big. Oh, there we go. Stefan Skellen. Found him. There we go. Uh, then we're going to do Shillard. Kahir. 
Shillard, and then Ka here. There we go. And then we are going to do Young Emissary. There should be two of them. We're going to do both of them. And then there we're going to do Vatir. I don't know who Vatir is. This guy. We're going to do Impera Brigade Guard. I should have four of these. Uh, yeah, I do have all four. Sweet. So I've got a pretty good deck here. I have a lot of spies, a lot of uh, power cards, a lot of hero cards, I should say. Um, I have a lot of cards that just give me a lot of bonus points. So we should be able to uh, get over 187 points really, really easily. Shout out to the person at uh, the link below on True Achievements. They helped greatly if this does help. So now that we have that set up, let's go ahead and do one more save. And let's get started. Let's get started with these four, potentially four, Gwent games, and uh, then we'll move on and see what's next. All right, play some cards. Let's get going. Full bet amount. What would you say to a few rounds of Gwent? All right, let's get it going. This is the first of four uh, Nilfgaardian Empire games that I'm going to be playing. We're set up to uh, go for 187 points in a single round of Gwent. And that is the killed it achievement so let's get started i think we got this hopefully first round we're gonna crush it and remember the leader card that we do have allows us to, to draw another card and i think we're gonna try to go for it all in this first round here we have a pretty nice deck so yeah we're gonna try to go for it all in this first round and we are going to use the leader card honestly asap to get that one card extra and then we're gonna crush it it would have been nice to take decoys i guess but whatever it's fine although i'm not able to use the empire uh the leader card yet but that's fine we're gonna go ahead and place down our spy. We're just trying to get a ton of freaking cards. We got another spy. Let's go. You love to see it. Mysterious elf. Gotcha. Let's see what else we can use. All right, come on. And bam. There we go. Did we get anything else? We did not get another spy. Oh, oh. Risky here. This is going to be a bit of a risky round. Um, Let's go ahead. And can I use the leader card? It's not letting me use the leader card. How do I use it? I don't know, man. I do not know. Uh, let's go ahead and burn up their top card. Let's just do that. Get that out of the way. That's a pretty good one to use. And then we'll see what they do next. So I may just pass this round. Oh, they're going to give me a card. Ooh, they're, they're putting down a spy. Sweet. Sweet. So they give me more points. Um, I don't know what to do. Yeah, honestly, I don't know what to do because I'm trying to make sure I get as many points as possible. So I think what I'm going to do is pass this round. Although that might have been a big mistake. <laughs> that might have been a huge mistake. And then we're going to let him give us more cards. I don't know what's happening, man. I actually don't know what's happening. Oh, God. I made a mistake trying to go this way. But I would love to use my, my leader card. Because the leader card gives an extra card. And I have a chance to get a spy card, right? So that'd be great. That'd be great if I could do that. If I could get Yennefer, that'd be, that'd be pretty awesome, too. It's the opponent's turn to start. Gotcha. So what is preventing me from using the leader card? I actually have no clue. <laughs> like, what's going on? I'm so confused. I should have seen the rules for the Nilf Guardian deck. Like, why it's not letting me use the leader card. Maybe it's on the final card. Maybe that's what's up. Well, basically, this round, we are using every single card that is available to us. We are not going easy on this opponent. And uh, we're hoping to get a minimum of 187 points. Even if we don't, remember, we have a few more Gwent games left that, uh, you know, we have the opportunity to do so in. But uh, that's just what we're hoping for. That's just what we're hoping for. No stress if we don't get it. We're hoping to at least win. At the very least, we're hoping to win. All right, let's do it. Yeah, the key here, or like the goal that I'm going for is first off to win. I don't think I can get the achievement in this round, but it's also just good for us to see how we're gonna be able to unlock this achievement. You know, like prepare ourselves for understanding what the best way to unlock it is. I think that's, that's kind of what... Uh, this initial Gwent matches for. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. Okay, they're going to place a spy down. We got more points. You love to see it. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started with loading up a bunch of cards on the first row. I think that is what is up. We're going to put down these three these three guys first, the three three point cards, and then we're going to save the two uh the two five point cards for next round. I think that's what's up. Um okay. Oh, let's, let's actually zoom in on the Empire of our Emrys. Uh, draw a card from your opponent's discard pile. Oh, okay. That's what we do. Interesting. I didn't know that was, that was what that card did. I don't know what card I just lost. I, I don't know. Let's let's see what card I just lost. It was probably one of the spies. Yeah, it was one of the spies they gave us. 
That'd be cool if we could draw a card from our opponent's discard, but it's not letting us. Maybe the oh, so annoying. I hate it. Oh my god, stop using Scorch, dude. Uh, yeah, maybe maybe they don't have any cards for us to pull. I don't know. I don't know what's up. Please don't use another Scorch, dude. Please. Okay, not too bad for us. We're gonna go ahead and place this bad boy down. Bam. Nicely done. And we can't do anything else. Yeah, we can't do anything else. I'm gonna go ahead and let them just uh, play this round out. Hopefully we win. We shall see, I suppose. Yeah, hopefully we win. All right, come on, do your worst. Do your worst, buddy. You're gonna give us a spy? Sure, whatever. Whatever you say. All right, Tibor. You got it, whatever. Oh my God, dude, just hurry up. Hurry up and win if you're gonna win. My goodness. Are they gonna run out all, all their cards? Really? This is what they're doing? Oh, are they, are they winning? No, they're literally, oh, they could win. Let's see it. Oh, they're not winning. They ran out of all their cards and somehow I managed to win with the two remaining cards. It's a good thing I held on to them. But geez, this guy sucks. I can't believe it. I'm surprised that I won. I was like, I was not performing well enough. That's crazy that I won. All right, well, sweet. There we go. That is one out of four Gwent games won. Still no achievement, but I think we'll get it in these four, this four amount of games. You get what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying. Anyways, let's continue. Let's continue. All right. Next one, right over here. The merchant should have some Gwent for us to play. I don't know what Gwent card I just got, um, but I'm sure it was a good one. It looked like a neutral card to me. All right. How about a game of cards? Let's go. Uh, yep. Oh, Wouldn't I set the bad amount of five, but that's fine. Whatever. Okay. Let's see. I think we got this, guys. We don't, we don't, we don't need to change our deck at all, but uh, yeah, let's start up the game. We just need a lot of spies. If we can get a lot of spies, that'd be great. Now the leader card isn't. Oh, is it because it was a Nilf Guardian deck? That it that we're we weren't allowed to use our leader cards? That'd be really interesting if that was the case. But yeah, it seems like that might be what's up. We're not allowed to uh use the leader card against the Nilf Guardian deck. Cool. Alright, I start off, sure. I'm gonna go ahead and use the lovely spy. Let's go. Ooh, you know what I can do? If I have the leader card, I'm gonna use Villantrameth, and I'm gonna go ahead and scorch. Oh, they used a decoy. Crap. That's fine. That's fine. But if I, if they have, uh, you know, if it, let's say if this guy is the most powerful card in their front row, I can use the Scorch Dragon to burn, to burn that card and then pull it back. Ooh, I think I can do it. I can actually do it. Sweet. So <laughs> you love that. All right. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to use the leader card to then get our spy back and then place it back down. Oh, we're kind of vicious. This is a fun deck. This is actually a, a, a more fun, a more fun, a funner. This is, this is a deck that is more fun than I expected. I was trying to be grammatically correct there. All right, so we're gonna go ahead, pull that pull that card back. <laughs> Sweet, dude, this is awesome. Okay, he's gonna use uh, Dijkstra. We got a spy on our side. Okay, and then we're gonna go ahead and place that back down. Let's see, do we get another spy? Oh, we do. Oh my God, you love that mysterious elf. Oh, the best freaking spy card. The best spy card, that is for sure. All right, sweet. We have so many cards. Holy dude, we have we have a ton. All right, can we get 187 points? I have a feeling we just might. Okay, and I think what I'm gonna do, huh? What should we do? Because I I could just win. I could just potentially win this round. But I think what I'm gonna do is try and win the next round. Yeah, I'm gonna pass and try and win the win the next round. I'm gonna use this guy to pull back uh, one of the spies that I have to place it down. And then uh, we'll see what's up next after that. Yeah, we're going to let them win the first round. I'm going to hopefully get 187 points in this round. And then uh, we'll crush the following round. I think we got this. I think we got this. We're going to do so freaking well. All right. Opponent has passed. Sure. Whatever, buddy. I'm just going to honestly. Huh. I'm just going to do this. Yeah. Oh, but that might be a waste. Hold on. Let's see what I can do. Let's see what I can do. I could place down. Hmm. You know, I'm going to place this guy down. Screw it. I'm going to place this guy down and then we're going to get that spy. We're going to get it in our hands. We're going to go ahead and give them seven points. That's fine. And then we get two cards in our deck. Great. Sweet. And we got another spy. Great. And then what we're going to do, I think this is the call, is to just pass. Because we win. We're going to win the second round and then we're going to win, win the third round with 187 points. That would be beautiful. That would be beautiful. 
or more than 187 points, I should say. Yeah, look at that. Bam. Let's get another spy. Come on, come on. Okay, okay, Yennefer, that's fine. We do have another spy in our discard pile. We're about to have every single card in our hand. If you see, we only have three cards in our deck left. So we're about to have every single card in our hand. This is gonna be awesome. Okay, there we go, Yennefer, let's go. And we are going to be placing down, let's do Taller since he is the lowest amount for them. Sweet, and let's see, did we get another spy? We did not, but that's fine. We're missing one card from our, from our deck. We're doing pretty well overall, sweet. All right, now it is time to load up four points. We're gonna start off with all of the hero cards. Just get them out of the way since they're the safest cards to put down. They won't be killed immediately. And let's let the opponent just uh, do their thing. You know what I'm saying? Let's let them do their thing. Okay, we got that guy. That spy, I can't do anything with that spy, so we're just going to leave it. Um, if I had a decoy, I could. But then we clutter up the deck with things that we don't necessarily need to build points. You know what I'm saying? We're good. We're good. We got this. Okay, we're going to place down Tibor Egbrak. That's 44 total points. Ooh, we're crushing it. We are 100% crushing this game. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Although, the the enemy is actually doing much better than I expected. But I have a feeling that they're not going to be able to get past my point value. You know what I'm saying? Because we have the Commander's Horn and we have Dandelion. So, we're going to have two rows that are powered up like crazy. Okay. Girl Trivia, go down. And we're winning just using hero cards. Of course we got this achievement in the bag, bro. Let's do it. Okay. All right. Now we're starting off with our 10 point cards. Let's go crazy. Let's go crazy with it. Okay. If they have a Scorch, they're probably going to be destroying some of my useful cards. So I think I'm going to go ahead and start placing this, the weaker ones down just so that way we're not losing the valuable cards. You know what I'm saying? Okay. There we go. Then we're going to place down five. And then we're going to place down a three. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's the move. That is definitely the move. All right. They're currently winning, but we're about to crush them once we place everything down. They only have three cards left. Let's see what they can do to us. Okay. They got Vess. That's not bad. They're actually doing pretty well with points, but I'm going to do better. That's for sure. I am definitely going to do better. All right. It looks like they wouldn't actually be able to use Scorch because they have an 18 point card. So if they use, or they have a 20 point card even. So if they use Scorch, they're just going to destroy their own cards. So we're good to lay them all out. Let's go. All right, go ahead and pass, buddy. Go ahead and pass. Hell yeah. The opponent has passed. Let's go. We are about to unlock this achievement. Let's go. We are placing down every single one of our cards. Oh, beautiful. It's a beautiful sight. And we're about to place Dandelion down, and that is going to unlock us our achievement for sure. Let's see it. Oh, yeah. 178 points total. We need 187 for the achievements. We are placing down Dandelion. Bam. We now have... Oh, holy, dude. Oh, my God. We now have 261 points, but we're not done there. We're going to go ahead and power up the middle row, and now we have 281 total points. We have won the final round and won the Gwent game. Damn. That is a lot of damage. That is a ton of points, and there is our achievement. We have killed it. Hell yeah, we won a round of Gwent with a total strength of at least 187. Oh my god, that's beautiful. That was freaking awesome. That Nilf Guardian deck crushed. Ooh, holy, that was sweet. All right, let's continue on. Uh, so that is great. We unlocked the Killed It achievement, and now we just have some Gwent to play. I got a ghoul as a reward. That is awesome. What we're going to do is just go back, go into the uh, inn. We're going to take, go ahead and talk take we're gonna go ahead and talk to the skelliger or to the innkeep oh my god my mind's frazzled because that achievement um <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and start playing some gwent i'm gonna switch back to the northern realms i think you're yeah. need to play a few rounds of gwent yeah we are set me straight sweet man you love to see it all right see so yeah, i'm switching back to the northern realms deck nilf guardian was a lot of fun honestly but i think uh i want to be quick and the nilf guardian deck is not a quick deck we're just trying to crush it we're trying to win and crush these enemies so let's keep it going. Let's keep this train moving. All right, let's do it. This is freaking awesome. That was so dope unlocking that achievement. Holy. All right, so we're gonna start off with our hero cards and we're definitely gonna be placing down the mysterious elf. Okay. Oh, even they are. All right, you know what? I can do it too. I can do it too, buddy. All right, you loser. Here we go. Bam. Yeah, you wanna do it? I'll do it too. We got Scorch too. 
Nice. Okay. Six might be the highest point card so far, so I can safely place down one. And I can safely place down my hero card over there, too. And if they place down a spy, I do have decoys, so that is great for us. They're going to probably use that spy that I just placed. So we're going to get another spy. That is awesome. Sweet. There we go. And so let's see what's up. Let's see what's up. Okay. That is their highest point card. I might just go ahead and use a Scorch right now. Get that taken out. Bam. You suck. You're trash. All right. And then they've got a Dwarven Skirmisher. They're going to bring their allies. If they power up that roll, I'll destroy them. Oh, well, I won't be able to destroy them, actually. But that's fine. That's fine that they have that. Um, let's see. We're going to place down. Yep, we're going to place down Sultan Chevet. Um, we're going to just try to run down their cards at this point. I think that's what's up. See, so yeah, if they have Commander's Horn, they could do some damage to us. Hmm. Only 12 points? You suck. Oh, God. This is a bit of a risky game. Maybe I should have stuck with the Nilf Guardian deck. That was a pretty solid deck. Okay, sweet. So they place down a spy. We're going to go ahead and pick up that spy and place it right back down. Of course we are. Of course we are. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to place down Dennis Cranmer. Gotcha. And then we're going to go ahead and place down the spy. I think it's fine if we let them win this round. I don't think we will, though. But we'll see. It's not the end of the world, right? Do I have anything in my deck? No, I only have Scorch. Holy, yeah, they used a ton of useful cards in this round. So if I just let them win, you know, it's no damage to us, if you ask me. Yeah, I'm not stressing. I'm not stressing if I just let them win. So let's go ahead and uh, end the round after we collect maybe Printfed Reeves. Yeah, let's collect Printfed Reeves and then let's end the round. All right, not too shabby. Oh, they passed. Sweet. So yeah, we're going to end the round there. They have five cards in their deck. I think we're going to crush them. I think we can easily crush that. Yeah. Yeah, we have a pretty nice nice deck right here. And we also have a medic, so we're going to be able to bring someone back. Sweet. Villain Tremeth. Okay. Gotcha. Not too bad. Not the not the worst uh, enemy to face, and that's also good. That's the highest... Uh, that's the point ceiling, if you want to call it that. So if I use Scorch, I'll destroy Villain Tremeth. Sweet. All right, let's bring someone back. Who are we bringing back? Sultan Chevet. Gotcha. We have 15 points, five points in each row. That's a nice sight. I kind of like that. Okay, Yavin, we got you. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead just destroy Villain Tremeth. It's an easy one to do. And we might even call back the Medic. Ooh. I think we might do that. Yeah. All right, sweet. Doing it. Then we're going to uh, bring back another card. You love to see it. You love to see it. Our opponent has passed. Okay, what is the call here? What is the call? Can I call back anybody? I don't have anybody to call back, actually, now that I think about it. So if I place down a six-point card, is that a good call? That might be. That might be the move. We place down six points, and then we can power up this row. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah, let's, let's just power up the row. That's the call. They only have one card in their deck, which I just realized. We got this. So let's pass. Bam. All right, last round. What you gonna do? What card you guys gonna place, huh? Trash, probably. Probably placing down trash. Let's go. Let's go. We are definitely winning this. Are you kidding me? We are definitely crushing you. Bam. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Biting Frost. Not too bad. Not too bad. Hey, there we go. All right, we win. That's another victory in Skellige. That is the three out of four of uh, of the session taken care of. And all three victories. You love to see it. No failures yet. No failures at all. All right. That is a victory. That is another one for us. Sweet. And then one more Gwent game. And then we're going to check out the Miraculous Guide to Gwent. Asir Var Anahid. Asir Var Anahid. Um, let's see. This person up here. Yeah, the blacksmith. This person should actually have the last uh gwent game for us in this area yeah this was this was a great area for gwent oh my god this was crazy there were so many gwent games and i figured we gotta Let's tackle a lot cards. of gwent this is a good gwent spot to get because they're all in one bundle okay sweet now let's just start it up yeah let's just start it up no no changes to my uh, Nilfgaardian guardian deck let's do it let's do it all right 
and we are pretty solid with that spy uh yeah i like this deck i do dig this deck so we're pretty happy let's get it going let's get it going oh it's a monster deck huh and i have a biting frost beautiful beautiful you love to see it all right and we got dijkstra we are crushing it we are crushing it they have mysterious elf too but that's fine that's no uh no matter to me keep it going all right decoy they're gonna pick up dijkstra they better use dijkstra if they're gonna pick him back up so that way i can pick him back up we're gonna go ahead place down another spy you love to see it let's go coffee's all done i'm definitely energized right now that was very nice coffee i gotta be honest all right Tyler, go down we have so many points oh my god we have so many points right now or cards i should say we could get a lot of points this round and if we get more than 187 points that would be crazy you know i built out that custom uh nilf guardian deck which was purposefully made so that way we could get a ton of points but if we just randomly get it with, with the northern realm that'll be pretty badass that would be pretty badass okay so i can burn i can burn their cards sweet and this should win yeah this should win the round for us beautiful all right let's pass and let's uh let's crush it let's crush this monster deck and hopefully win this round because i don't want to do another round i want to get to something else this is enough gwent i played enough gwent for now <laughs> all right let's go starting with hero cards and we'll see what we can burn with scorch if anything yeah if we even burn anything all right sweet i think i'm gonna place this card down yeah oh here we go arakas you love to see it let's see are they all four okay all right sweet so what i'm gonna do what i'm actually gonna do here is place down villain tremeth beautiful and they get fried up they get fried up real quick i might use a decoy to pull back villain tremeth we'll see oh yeah we're doing it we're definitely doing it and they're all four except for that one that's a five point card but that's fine oh i can mitigate the front row with biting frost and then use the scorch dragon to fry them all up that would be beautiful keep blowing up the front row bro just keep blowing up the front row all right sweet 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 let's go i'm gonna i'm gonna let them keep building it up though for now i think that's the move okay let's go ahead and mitigate the back row so i can place down some cards without too much worry about them being uh, hit by scorch yeah that's what's up okay let's go let's go let's go all right bam there we go we're gonna place down a catapult and then we're gonna place down crimson reeves i think all right sweet keep it up keep lone monsters up god i can't wait it's gonna be so exciting to see that entire row just burn once it gets loaded up oh my god yeah call in call in the crones call them all in dude hell yeah oh my god oh my god this is beautiful this is beautiful yeah i won't even need to use a ton of cards to uh to win honestly all i need to do is burn that front row oh you're you're an idiot you're an idiot for passing dude come on now look at this look at this i feel kind of bad i feel kind of bad but i don't at the same time yeah <laughs> oh my god sorry guys a bit of a cough there um one sec just had to clear my throat <laughs> but yeah look look at their points they went from 100 all the way to freaking 30 and now they have nothing basically they, they have nothing you're trash oh my god that was beautiful and they've already passed so we win there we go that is another gwent victory oh my god we crushed it we did so well today all right now with that done let's see we have now collected keleano harpy seleano Sil harpy whatever you saw it you read it too right we're gonna go to the miraculous guide to gwent and let's see what our card count is because we should be pretty close at this point okay let's see read uh we are missing eight cards wow we're still at eight i feel like we were closer but i guess i was totally off so we are missing eight more cards which is only eight more games of gwent which is no stress um although i feel like some games don't reward us with the card so maybe that's why we're still at eight but there we go only eight more games we're gonna try to complete whatever games in skelliga and uh only one more game at care Morhen, which is lambert for the gwent old palace side quest which hopefully we get to talk to him soon because we are headed to care Morhen in ugly baby but i think first off what i want to do is go to the contracts 
and go to the one that I mentioned earlier, which is, uh, what is it? What is the one I mentioned earlier? Door slamming shut. Yeah, yeah it's door slamming shut. So let's go over that way. And then uh, maybe we do ugly baby. Maybe we don't. We'll see how much time we have. Um, and we'll get to it. We'll definitely get to it. So yeah, let's keep moving. Oh, oh, we're already here. Door slamming shut. Oh, no, no. We have to go to Novograd. My bad. My bad. I thought the icon was uh, in Skellige. Yeah, that is in Novograd. Here we go. Right by Hierarch Square. And while we're here, I'll sell stuff too. Yeah, that'll be a good idea. Oh, man. Feels good. We did so much today. It's awesome. It is freaking awesome. All right, come on. Let's skip it. All right, here we go. We are moving forward. Oh, I'm getting kind of hungry in real life. I must add. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit hungry. Uh, I wonder what I'm going to eat today. I do have some takeout, some leftovers. That would be yummy. Some fried rice. Ooh, that is really good. And some like spicy calamari. Ooh, that'll be so good. I'm pretty hungry. <laughs> I'm thinking about food right now. That's how hungry I am. Okay, uh, we're going to go ahead and repair everything that is equipped. And we're also going to go ahead and sell everything that we got. If I can go to the shop. There we go. We're going to sell. Yeah, we're going to sell all this. Because I am focusing on the uh, Griffin armor. I'm not using any of this. Uh, we don't need it. We're just going to go ahead and hopefully get a ton of money built up. So that way we can afford to build out the armor. And apparently the final tier, which I think there's an achievement related to uh, crafting the final tier of uh, armor for this Griffin set for any Witcher school gear, I should add, not just Griffin. Um, apparently you have to spend like 50,000 crowns just to afford it, which is brutal. Just, just completely brutal. That is so much money in this game specifically. Like that is just so much money. So I don't know how we're going to be able to afford that. I'm sure there's a method for grinding out coins. So uh, yeah, that's what's up. That's what's going to be up in the future. But that's that's going to be like in the DLC and the final DLC. I think that's what we have to do. So we'll get to it when we get to it. For now, we're just going to continue to build out our Griffin gear and level it up with us as we go along. We're going to continuously upgrade it. And uh, it's honestly pretty badass. I like it a lot and I'm excited to see what the next version looks like. Okay, let's talk to Kurt Dysart in the Kingfisher Inn. It's been a while since we've been back here. When was the last time we were back here? Potentially for, uh, what was her name? What, what's Dandelion's uh, girl's name? I don't remember. Priscilla? Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's the last time we were here. All right, Kurt Dysart, what is up? Yes? Kurt Dysart? Count Kurt Dysart. Are you here regarding the contract? Hmm. Wanted to hire a witcher, didn't you? I did, but not just any vagabond. One hears all manner of stories about the lunatics of the school of the cat. Which do you belong to? School of the Wolf. It, it's School obvious, right? Wolf. Look at the, look ah, at the pendant. Yeah. A good one. I knew a witcher of this school. Barnabas? Uh, no. Though his name did begin with a B. Never mind. Uh, to the matter at hand. Not long past, I acquired an estate east of Novigrad. I got it on the cheap, you see. The seller was very keen to be rid of it. Now, I've learned, the building is set to be haunted. Ghost to explain the seller's urgency. I do not believe in ghosts. It is that simple. But my men say the house shakes at night. Walls crumble. Why, even the floors move about. Interesting. Is there anything to be done? A remedy for this? I'll tend to it. Of course I will. Fine. I'm willing to investigate. How do I get there? An orchard adjoins the property. The house itself you should recognize easily. Cracks cover its walls. Here's the key. And good luck. All right. Sweet. Let's get going. Doors slamming shut. Let's get it done. And we're pretty close with the amount of contracts that we have. I think we have five more left. I'm not sure about the total count. But we're really close with the amount of contracts. I think we have one, two maybe, in Skellige left. And then, you know, the rest in Novigrad, which were leveled, almost leveled up, leveled up enough for, I think we can easily crush a lot of them. So we might be really close to completing every single contract in the game, which is just beautiful. It's just awesome to say that we're getting really close to the end of the main game. It's just so satisfying. Oh my God. We're going to pop so many achievements and we've been popping achievements, right? You know what I mean? Like we popped an achievement in this video, but we're popping so many achievements now that we're getting to the end of things. Oh, beautiful beautiful sight and we're gonna pop an achievement for completing the final widget contract oh lovely to say this is the area where we saved uh dandelion yeah. isn't it yeah yeah yeah. it is wow it's nice to be back here 
it's not it's very nice to be back here that was the last quest in novigrad i believe it was at, at least yeah that was like one of the last main quests in novigrad and then we headed over to skellige oh wow what what a what what a journey <laughs> you know what i'm saying what a journey we've been on with this game that is crazy okay so this is let's investigate house. um okay it's haunted doors move around and stuff uh the floors rearrange themselves this should be an interesting quest that is for sure all right what do we got Ooh, yeah and things move clearly left in a hurry but a specter would have attacked me already interesting a specter would have attacked already and there's something below us we already saw that cool let's go all right what's below air flowing through this crack there's something in there crack where's the crack right here gotcha hard let's go Ooh, what do we got no yo in a while this is crazy hmm. looks like a journal we're we going through a portal no way we're going through a portal yeah no we're not we're not okay there's something in there it sounds like a huge golem okay we're gonna read that journal there we go investigate the basement using your witcher senses what else is over here Ooh, we got something over there yeah let's check it out let's check it out Got any loot in the water i don't see any just keep it going oh but this is cool this is this is very interesting we gotta pull that lever hopefully it opens up the door hopefully it opens up something at least okay something clicked all right so that's that area over there i think that's what opened yeah that door back there beside the diary um how do i get up there yeah it's open sweet uh let's see what do we got oh yeah oh yeah look at that what's going on why is it like covered up okay interesting very interesting let's see what we got hello an earth elemental pretty powerful too powerful eh oh Almost jesus to break its magic bonds a few days more and it would have wreaked havoc all around got to free it first then defeat it deactivate the magic barrier how do i do that oh boy what did i do do i have to crush it oh oh i can crush it eh let's do it that's cool so now what now that i've destroyed the support sure that would collapse on my head okay interesting and then i just oh ow jesus that hurt um okay what's happening oh we just fight oh god okay okay uh all right let, let's deal with the oh my god that looked like a scary attack okay let's go on put on elemental oil uh what else can we use probably ard maybe a bomb yeah we'll see what we got we'll see what we got oh boy all right sweet yeah we're doing a bit of damage we got this we got this we'll crush it holy this thing's got a ton of health all right so it's an earth elemental let's see what else we can do yeah hit it hit it with some ard probably right and we'll hit it with a bomb let's see what the bomb does bam let's go bomb did nothing if we're being honest okay relax buddy bam ard did nothing as well oh geez okay let's see what else let's see what else we can do maybe maybe a different bomb maybe a different bomb like enhanced salmon um. i don't think that'll do much but we'll see ow that hurt me more than it hurt it okay well that's fine uh dragon stream dancing star we'll try that let's see what it does ow i can't i can't, can't even hit it i'm blinded right now all right bam let's go that what i still have salmon oh i thought i equipped the dancing star all right here we go bam there we go bro can i hit it can i get it dancing star equipped what is going on it's not actually equipping it that sucks whatever it's not letting me switch bombs right now i'm just gonna go ahead and equip the bolt maybe that'll help me switch bombs we shall see for right now let's just focus let's just focus on doing damage bam yeah just keep attacking it keep attacking it while we got the chance bam let's go okay yeah yeah, yeah. oh nice all right let's go put elemental oil back on inventory let's go here we are elemental oil bam all right sweet okay 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 oh ho, ho, damn dude chill out we're doing like very little damage but we're like like hitting away at it you know what i'm saying like we're slowly <laughs> we're slowly chipping away at its health but god it's taking forever all right can i switch bombs now can i switch a dancing star thank you that doesn't do any damage how about devil's puffball that might do some damage if we use dragon's dream along with it uh eh, not really that sucks all right igni time bam yeah that didn't do any well, well maybe we'll do urden maybe urden does something we uh, place it down we could trap it maybe do some damage to it bam let's go let's go all right sweet uh oh wow we, we did a lot of damage there maybe this is the key putting it in an urden 
and doing some damage to it. Ooh, I could have just looked at the bestiary, if I'm being honest, but like finding it out this way is cooler. <laughs> That's for sure. It's been a cooler experience. So I like that. All right, sweet. We're going to use the dragon stream again. Then we're going to go ahead and use Igni while we're at it. Ow, that hurt a lot. Although it didn't hurt me, but it was like a huge impact. That was scary. All right, sweet. All right, halfway there. Therazine is now halfway damaged. Oh, okay. Bam. Let's go. All right. All right, all right. We got it, we got it, we got it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, you love to see it. All right, bam, bam. There we go. Hell yeah. Oh. Yeah, we do so much damage inside of the Urden. Let's go. Bam. Oh, yeah. Therazine, get taken out. I'm beating your ass, literally. Like, sword is hitting your ass real hard right now. All right, bam. Although it looks like maybe maybe the Urden isn't the key because it looks like we're doing a lot more damage than we were before when he was outside of the circle. So I don't really know what the key is. <laughs> I have no clue what the key here is. All right, stop cowering away, Therazine. All right, Quen time. Let's get ready with it. Bam, let's go. All right, sweet. And we're doing a ton of damage right now. We're doing a ton of damage. Hell yeah, hell yeah. All right, bam, let's go. Woo, beautiful. Yeah. Oh. So close. Here we go. Here we go. Bam. Nice and done. All right. Here we go. And here we go. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. It's almost dead. It's almost dead. Therazine, you're about to be taken out, buddy. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, come on. Bam, bam. We're going to put it in Erden real quick, and then uh, we're going to take it out. Let's go. Oh, nice dodge. Nice dodge. All right, sweet. Boom. Yeah, hit me. You can't. That's what I'm talking about. All right, Therazine has been taken out. Ow. There we go. Nicely done. Holy, my game almost crashed. That was crazy. They, that went crazy, the frames. All right, sweet. And there is our reward. Let's turn it in. Let's get our reward. There's our trophy, I should say. But you get what I meant. You get what I meant. Uh, Let's go. Oh, oof, that was a bit of an, an intense one. I enjoyed it. I must be honest. I did enjoy it. But did the, yeah, did the area rearrange itself? It doesn't seem like it to me. Maybe because we killed it. It doesn't, but they said the floors move. Is it just the floors like shake because you're because of what's underneath it? Is that what they meant? I I took it as like the floors rearranged themselves, but I guess I'm mistaken. <laughs> I guess I was just like thinking thinking too much about it. Like I, I over exaggerated the meaning of the words, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. It's fine though. It's fine, we're gonna go ahead and collect our reward. Let's keep it going. Alright, sweet. Beautiful. Oh, man. This was a lot of fun. This was a lot of fun. I'm so glad we crushed the Gwent. I think we've unlocked every single Gwent achievement except for the card collector achievement, which is just, you know, for collecting all of the Gwent cards, which, you know, now there's only nine left. Oh, my God. It's crazy. It's crazy to say. We're so close. It's awesome. All right. Let's turn it in. Kurt Dysart. Yes. Give us our reward. Here to collect the reward, buddy. How shouldn't give you any more trouble. A little renovation and it should be fit for you to move into. Yeah. Truly? Why, the estate's price just spiked sharply. What precisely was the problem? Earth Elemental trapped in the cellar. It was just trying to get out. Almost demolished the house in the effort. Yeah. Mm, far more interesting than a ghost, that's certain. And the cellar you mentioned, is it a mistake to be furnished? Hard to say. Oh, I should see. Ah, uh, your bounty. There you are. And uh, farewell. Sweet. There we go. That is uh, doors slamming shut completed. Oh, that earth elemental was no joke, but it, we did take it out. We managed to kill it. Oh my goodness. All right. That was nice. That was a lot of fun. Okay. And I think there may be an achievement related to it, but it is not popping. Let's just give it a sec. Let's see if we can grab it. Grab it, get it. Let's see if we can get this achievement. Um, in the meantime, let's see what else we got in store for us. Oh, there we go. There is our achievement. Ashes to ashes. You love to see it. We completed the contract on Therazane. Therazane? Therazine? Therazane. We did that. Very nicely done. Um, yeah, like I said, let's see. We've got Ugly Baby over at Kermorin. But that's not a Kermorin. I guess it ends off at Kermorin. So we're going to tell the Baron Sergeant you want to talk to Uma. Um, and that's kind of it. That's kind of all we got to do of Swords and Dumplings. A feast for crows huh there might be some interesting side quests for us to take care of i don't think i want to take care of too many to be honest uh we're gonna leave a lot of them 
uh, Witcher contracts. I think this is all we need left. Oh man, we have a lot more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight more Witcher contracts left. I think one of them is actually related to the DLC. So we technically have seven contracts left. But uh, yeah, we're doing great. We're doing great. And I think that's where we're going to be ending this video. We'll get to Ugly Baby probably right away in the next video. So I do hope that you're looking forward to that. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I do hope that you did enjoy. And if you did enjoy, please do consider dropping a like. And if you enjoyed the content enough, please do consider sticking around and subscribing. All right, anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you have a great day. I will see you in the next one.